albeit not less than 24 hours in a literal sense. And we are underway. And the Clippers out to a quick 9-3 advantage. Wiseman, the roll man, boy, extending for the bucket. Donzali Wiseman, pardon me, Donzali Artis, Wiseman's mom, as Kawhi Leonard knocks down the elbow jumper. To bend to have a good measure of success this year. Those are the words of head coach Steve Kerr. He's got to stay aggressive because he's going to find himself having open shots, not just tonight, but all season long. With the three and shot. That's the way the team's going to defend Steph Curry. Baysmore into the game. He lost the handle. Curry fell down, and Batum has a little room service. Paul George, step back baseline jump shot. Got it. Smooth. Pops, I want to play hoop. I want to play basketball. It's worked out for him as Leonard went all the way to the basket. Bobby Jackson inbounding to Marcus Morris. Bernard on the backdoor cut and layup. Deep Clippers team. Curry probing underneath. Out to Wiggins from deep, and he knocks it in. He's made his looks count. Lou Williams working against Pascal. Lou Williams, one of the most combustible scorers off the bench in the league. Curry gives it up. Now going to play without the ball a little bit. Pascal pulls his away. Three two box for the bucket. It's a period on an 8-2 to two run. Back the other way, Luke Kennard, who signed that lucrative. See, back in the day, you didn't see it much. Now right. they're seeing more and more zones throughout the league. Marcus Morris said, I got it, clear it out. And he shot it right over the top of Wiggins. The lead up to 15 now. Pascal from deep, he's been working on that. Uh -huh. Is that what you're trying to say? Wiggins into the paint, strong move. Slow up the offense, Lou Williams. Morris, Zubox, Reggie Jackson as Williams throws in the floater and Kennard on the floor for the Clippers. Chemistry is life. Absolutely, and they have to have that mentality every single night because they had a lot to prove. Last year they walked around like they proved stuff that they really not trying to jump on. I'd be on edge every single night. And they have something to prove individually and collectively. Paul George, one of those guys, and proving something there. George pops out on the baseline off the screen, and Paul George hits nothing but net. It was interesting here, Ty Lue tell us that Marcus Morris came to him as Mulder takes the baseline three and knocks it in. Lee in transition to Pascal. Curry wide open. Great ball fake, and made it count. Curry with another three. To close out by Draymond Green. Raymond switches on to Beverly, and Ibaka there to have his back. And more power to you. You make that play, I'm believing that you're not going to make that play enough to beat me. I know if we allow Steph Curry to get going, you're going to beat me. Curry over the midcourt line, 12 points. Blows by Beverly, and tells Ibaka too late. Behind him wide open. If you're going to sell out, you have to make sure he doesn't have the opportunity to get the basketball back. Kawhi with those quick, large hands. George off glass and banks it home on his. Leonard backs it out against the rookie Wiseman. Kawhi steps back and hits nothing but net. Uh, Leonard again here, coming off the screen to an open Paul George. Paul George, hotter than fish grease here in the first half. 92% from three-point territory this year. Beverly on the blow by counted and won. Uh, no, you never asked me who would control it. No, no too late. Too late. <laughs> That's a win for Patrick Beverly. Sure is. Especially if Paul George knocks that in, which he does. Doing it on that sequence. Draymond misses. Wiseman corralling it and punching it. Oh, man. What a quick second jump that was, Mark. Together. Paul George's answer was basically, hey, if you put the work in, maybe preferential treatment just comes your way, Malik Andrews. In training camp, he participated in every single one because he wanted to show that that is the player who's going to show up.
you want him to take more shots, but then you look and you say, okay, well, could he have forced it as Kawhi knocks down a shot? Yes, but give him credit. He's not trying to do too much. I, I believe he's ultimately thinking he's not playing for right now. He's playing to build these guys because he's going to be step third. Boy, Oubre is really out of sorts. Cross court, Paul George rising up. Fouled and won. Count it. They go to work on him. Elbow mid range, pure butter. Leonard heating up here in the third based on the way they just eviscerated and dismantled Clemson. That was a surprise. They sure Curry did. for three. They sure did. Gotta keep an eye on him if you're Ohio State. He plays for Alabama. Molden. On the break, count it, and the, the dribble handoff to Curry. Nice look inside, Looney off a great time by Mulder. Worse with the step back, short, and here's Curry in transition. Working against Leonard, and got the layup to go. Just missing, and Curry quickly the other way. Pulls up from deep, got it! Splash to Curry! See if he can help out Curry, the offensive end. Curry into the paint. Waltzes down the lane. Warriors control. They got a little bit of time. Bazemore out to Curry. Catch and shoot. Got it! Smoke from Steph to end the third quarter. With the ball isolated against Zubats. Steph finds the open man. Lee all alone in the corner. Got it! And here come Golden State. Golden State hasn't led since it was 3-2. Paul George with the mid-range jumper, good. Wanamaker, the ball handler. Pascal, strong for the bucket. Wanamaker up court. Off the drag screen, Pascal pick and pop. Got it! And the Warriors lead it by three. Baysmore with good defense on George there. Zubat sets the screen for Williams. Williams with the feathery touch floater. Hard against Zubats. Put his body into him. And got it to shot clock down to 10. Baysmore, an open three look. Got it. Can Baysmore pointing to the heavens? And the passion that your team is playing with right now. The tomb swings it corner to Kennard. And Kennard drills the side pop. Paul George. Now Wanamaker switches on to him. The corner kick out to Ibaka, who knocks the game at 97. The Warriors. An awful offensive possession by the Clippers. Wanamaker for the lead, got it! Brad Wanamaker. You forced Steph Curry to defend Kawhi Leonard and Paul George. That time Wiggins stayed with Leonard. Fadeaway mid-range is good. Curry being guarded by Ibaka. Ibaka guarding him. Out by the midcourt line, Wanamaker, pardon me, Wiggins missed. Here's Wanamaker, and hits another one. Extra pass Batum, he's made a bunch of those, and continues to trend. Almost went out of bounds, they got it back, right to Curry. Wiggins hustling for the board, and put back. Andrew Wiggins with a big bucket. Curry guarded by Ibaka. Steph on the drive by Wild. Tough shot! Circus time! Steph Curry! Curry snakes around the screen. Three guys go to him in green. Looks like a layup drill. Six point lead. Wiggins on George. Andrew Wiggins! Trying to put this one on ice. The productive, prolific hands of Steph Curry. In his bag, deep! Like the fries are at the bottom. Triple this one out. Baysmore, one of the catalysts defensively in the second. That man has been the anchor of Utah's defense. He's been the best paint protector in the NBA, period, for the last three, four years. And yes, he deserved the money. I didn't like what Shaq said. I didn't like that. That's I didn't like it.